Hey, what is going on? This is Rob from Panther. Today we're going to check it out some impossible typo in Illustrator. I'm going to select the type tool, click. I'm going to type in the letter D. I'm going to scale it up. I'm going to choose nice typo. I'm going to try out Nexa. Nexa bold. So I'm going to go here to object, expand, click OK. Scale this up a little more. I'm going to press and hold alt, drag it to the right. Also press shift to isolate until they intersect right here. See that? So we got both. I'm going to swap it here, here from fill to stroke. I'm going to increase the stroke thickness, make the letter D big. So as you can see, also the stroke got thicker because I activated the scale stroke and effect. Because of that, you know, if I scale it up, it's going to increase the stroke thickness, but I'm going to need some more. I'm going to select both, press Shift plus M, or you can go and select the Shape Builder tool. And I'm going to select this and I'm going to connect like so. Then I'm going to go from here and connect these three shapes. I'm also going to add some colors and some texture. So I, I right now I'm on the fill. I'm going to select the yellow and I'm going to select the other one. I'm going to select the other color. I'm going to select the yellow. I'm going to press Control C and then Control F, or you can go to Edit, Paste in front. This is going to paste another copy on the front. I'm going to click on the uh, stroke, click on None, click on the fill. I'm going to go to the gradients, click on the gradients. Let me check, click type in 90 degrees. There you go. So the dark side is going to be on the top. From here, I'm going to go to the effects, pixelate and color half tone. Now we got channel one, two, three, four. I'm going to decrease it to zero, 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 zero. And the max radius, I'm going to increase it to 15. Now it really depends, uh, you know, on the canvas size. How big is it? Minus 1080p. Okay, we got this. I'm going to go to object, expand appearance. I'm going to go to image trace. You can see this little uh, arrow here. I'm going to click on it and select three colors. Boom, there you go. I'm going to click on expand, right click on group, and I'm going to select this shape. And I'm going to go to select same fill color. And I'm going to press on delete. And basically, now I'm left with these. Thanks for watching and if you're new on the channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you can notify with daily updates and also check out the rest of the videos at the end. Have a good one. Bye bye.